Terry, I love you. I spent a lot of time trying to put into words why I love you, but I always felt too cliche or not enough to express my feelings. I don't feel like the words exist. feels like such a cop-out. <laughs> but it really is how I feel. I know things I love about you. I love your ambition. I love your smile. I love your little interactions with our pets. I love so many little things about you that make up all of you, and I love the sum of them even more. could list a bunch of reasons how I know, but then we wouldn't have time to eat or dance before they kicked us out tonight. <laughs> <laughs> so I'll set up my favorite. I know because the word boop popping up on my phone makes my day. I see you in myself, and I know that it's because I've chosen to be more like you. I see you doing the same with me, and I know that we've made each other stronger. I'm excited to spend my life with you and continue growing with you. Five years ago to this day, I was going through a very difficult time. I was only 19, still learning my place in the world, and under a significant amount of pressure from everyone around me to live up to everything I'd set out to be. I went through every day wondering how I was going to push through to the next. Until, of course, one night in early September, you reached out to check in on me and ultimately asked me out. The rest is history. Without you to sweep me out of that incredibly rough patch, I don't know that I would be as remotely successful or happy as I am today. In the years that follow, both of us have grown so much. We've been through our share of troubles, but we've always been able to emerge stronger on the other side. When my childhood cat passed away, you didn't hesitate to drop everything and be my shoulder to cry on, and that was when I knew you were the one I wanted to be with for the rest of my life. You continuously helped support me through two and a half years with the struggle that is a degree from Georgia Tech, which several people in this room can attest to the difficulty of. <laughs> However, the thing that sticks out the most was your courage to decide to move across the country with me to this beautiful city that we now call home. You left behind everything of the home and people you love to live in a new place far away with little plans what would happen other than knowing that you would be with me. Out of everything you've done for me to this point, that is the one I am most grateful for, as I'm not sure I could have made it out here by myself. And in Seattle, we flourished and enjoyed so many amazing adventures so far. I love watching how much you care for our fur children, and I cannot wait to hopefully see you be an amazing father to a little human one day. I'm so lucky to be able to have someone as silly and goofy, but also as caring and supportive as you are, to be next to me for whatever comes our way. So today, on our wedding day, I want to say thank you. Thank you for all the wonderful things you've done for me in the past, and thank you for picking me, choosing me, and loving me as your best friend for this incredible journey called life. I'm so excited for this next chapter, and I wouldn't want to go through it with anyone else. I love you, Joseph Holland, and I'm the luckiest girl alive to be able to call you.